Hey everyone, welcome back. So today I'm going to a wedding and I've already got like half my outfit on but it's just because I know I won't be able to like put it on once my hair and makeup is done because it will ruin it. But it's like, I think it's like an hour away. We were planning on leaving at 12 and it's already 11.30 so that's not going to happen. So my mum said we just have to leave before 1 so I'm just going to do my normal glam i don't even know but this is the outfit it's the same outfit i bought for eid in like last year i guess um i haven't got the trousers on yet though because i don't want to put the full outfit on yet it all creased i just got the top on um but yeah i'm just gonna i think i'm gonna do my makeup first i'm gonna curl my hair because i haven't done that in so long so i think the last time was like diwali so i'm gonna do that um and do my makeup and i'm so excited because my birthday was last weekend so i got i got some new makeup and i'm gonna try it all out today so yeah i'm really excited okay so my camera is all set up now and i've learned from my mistake i need to put it on this side of my desk otherwise you won't be able to see me because the light is here um i'm gonna just moisturize first because i just washed my face and it's a bit dry but I hope it doesn't make my like makeup separate because that's happened before. If it does, I'll just have to like remove the cream. Got my nails done. <coughs> Why is my voice like that? I got my nails done last week and I'm getting used to it. Like obviously I've never had acrylic, so it's a bit different. But I love them. I always just fit them. <laughs> really clean like my face looks really clean I don't know why so I'm really excited for all my makeup like literally everything I'm using is brand new I got it last week for my birthday apart from this but I never actually use it so but I got this CC cream Disha got it for me it's like to remove redness and obviously I have like red cheeks so I'm gonna use that I don't want to use foundation so I'm gonna use that because I did get a foundation for my birthday as well for my mum um, but I'm, I don't really want to use it because it's too heavy, so I'll just use this. Okay, I look a bit crazy right now with the clips in, but <clears throat> my bangs were like coming in to my face. But I'm gonna just start. I'll just yeah, I'll just start. So I'm gonna use the Elf Power Grip Primer. I literally never use that much of it, but I feel like I really want this makeup to stay because we're gonna be at this wedding like all day, so I'll just put loads. Okay, when I first tested out the CC cream, I used a brush, but I don't remember what brush I used, and it worked really well. But I'm going to guess it's this foundation brush from Sheen. It's really dusty though, so I don't want dust to stick on my face. So I'm just going to rub it. Okay. So, let's use this CC cream. I'm so excited. I really hope it doesn't separate though. Otherwise, I'll have to start again. Like, I'll have to rub everything off. Start again. Also, I literally don't have any spoolies. I only have one and it's got, like, stuff on it. This is my last one. I didn't even know it was my last one until I was, like, looking for another one. There wasn't one. So, don't know how I'm going to do my brows, but I'll just have to make it work. But yeah, let's just put it on. I I want to remove this as well, but I don't want it to get like infected, so I'm not gonna touch it. Up. But yeah, because I put quite a lot, I'm gonna put it like that much. And I don't usually put it on my chin, but I'm not leaving anything out, so. The only thing is, I feel like you kind of need a lot for it to actually cover stuff. Unless my brush just kind of takes it all in. <coughs> my throat is like really dry. I'm just going to go over the spot. Hopefully nothing happens to it. It looks a bit orange. But my skin looks so glowy. Like, And look, the, like there's no redness. Like, Obviously it, it started off really red. But 
Whenever I do my makeup, I always forget my nose. My nose just turns out really splotchy and red, so I'm making sure to do it right now. I love this CC cream. Like, it looks just like my skin. Other side. Might have to put more though, because this brush is really just eating it all up. Yeah, I'm definitely going to put more. My hair's all in it though. And I did put some on my forehead last time, but for some reason my forehead makes everything separate. Like, it doesn't separate on my face, but it separates on my forehead. So, oh, I was about to put it on. I meant to put it on the cheek. Mm, I'll put a little bit like on the bottom, just because it's a bit red still. I'm gonna blend it down my neck okay perfect I love that so much like I just look like I have perfect skin now now I'm gonna do concealer maybe I saw a thing that you can put like setting spray in between but I'm not gonna try out anything new in case like I mess it up so just use concealer this is kind of not running out but it's getting low lower so I use it all the time. I'm just gonna put it on my forehead. Actually, I hate makeup on my forehead. Why does it always separate? I'm gonna actually take that off. I need, I can't be bothered to get like a makeup cloth. So I'll just use normal tissue. Guess we're not putting makeup again on my forehead. It just always separates and it's so annoying. But it's fine. Because my hair will be there anyway. It's a bit red now, so I'm going to just put some CC cream instead. Because I don't want that to just be red. And I feel like this won't make it patchy. Hopefully not. Because it's cream. I kind of love how that looked actually. I feel like the base is looking good. I'm not going to put contour or anything because I really don't know how to do that. Um, when I do it, it just looks really patchy. So I'm just going to use blush. And then my actual base is done basically. I just do this in blush. And maybe highlight because obviously it's a wedding. So I'll put some highlighter on. But this is the blush. It's from Rimmel. It's really good. I'm going to use the Real Techniques brush. This is a mini one but works the same. So I just smile <laughs> and put it on like the peak of my cheek. That's what my mom told me to do because I used to put blush like down here because like that's my where my natural blush is. But she's like you have to put it higher up. So that's what I learned. You can't really tell because the lighting is like kind of bad, but it's really pigmented. Like and it's actually powder. I have a cream one, but it doesn't even work. Like it doesn't stay at all. The powder ones work better. I just remembered I still need to do my hair so okay I think it's not too bad like the camera is just making it look awful I'm gonna just go up to my main mirror and sort it out because I'm kind of sad and scared that this is what I actually look like okay it looks like a lot on camera but it really isn't because I just went to the mirror and I sorted it out it looks really even so I'm not gonna mess it around I'm just gonna put some powder on it's like dust all over my powder puff though because it was just laying on my table for like a week it's setting it quite nicely which is good I'm going to put a bit more underneath my eye because one eye is brighter than the other. Okay, and that's like calm down the blush a little bit I hope. But I'm going to do the eyes now. So I'm going to do some eyeshadow. I'm going to like set the eyeshadow. 
I'm making a mess, but I'm gonna set it with this powder. It's quite dark, but it will do. This is actually like a concealer brush, but I don't use brushes for concealer, so. You know the Fenty, like, really sparkly highlighter? Like the diamond something. I wanted that one, but it's like £40. This is supposed to be a dupe for it. It's pretty good, so. The, I don't know how much this one is. It's from America. Probably, like, £6 or something. You can't even tell that color them. I just have short lashes. Oh, and eyelashes. And eyelashes, she just fell into my eye. I've got it right here. <coughs> that was annoying. Okay, I'm gonna use my new mascara because my other one is fully dried up. That was satisfying. <laughs> I want to put loads because I want to have really thick. Oh my god, I got on my cheeks. I want to have thick lashes. Yeah. They look really good. Okay. I'm gonna do eyeliner. Usual. Actually, I feel like I might use the new one I got for my birthday. It's a pot one, so I might completely mess up this whole look. But apparently, this one stays on like so well, so I might just use it. Comes with this tiny little brush applicator. I'm just gonna try it and see if I can even do a straight line on my hand. I'm not sure. I feel like I should try it though because mine just runs so much like the eyeliner it just that's the first thing that goes down my face we'll see let's try it out it's gonna take forever I've only done like the inner corner but I want it to look good so it's fine okay I've done that I'm not gonna put any more because I don't want to get too overconfident and then mess it up I don't like my eyelashes, but everything else looks perfect. I'm gonna just spray some setting spray on me. I think I've done what else for these two lips, but I'll do that later. I'll just put some lip balm on, but I'll do this first. Hold on. I'm scared. How do I do it? I just spray that right onto my mouth. <sighs> it's soaking wet, but I need to just looks glowy. I'm gonna just dry it with the fan. This was so nice. Cooling. I'm gonna just put the lip on my lip look because I feel like it looks incomplete and I want to see exactly what to put my lips. I'm gonna put this Charlotte Tilbury lip liner of course. I'm just putting some Vaseline on. But yeah, Charlotte Tilbury. This is in the shade Pillow Talk Medium. Because I tried it on in John Lewis, but I didn't actually buy it. So I got the lip liner instead. Because also, now that I have this, I'm realising that the Kiko ones are literally trying to copy it. Because why are they the same packaging? Like, even the lid and everything. These aren't even the sh same shade, though, so it's fine. They're different. But I'm now realising that they're trying to just copy Charlotte Tilbury. I was thinking of just doing lip liner and lip gloss, but I kind of really want to put lipstick on. I have one lipstick, which I'm going to use. It's the MAC one in shade Mare. And it kind of matches the lip liner. I'm not going to put too much, so I'm just going to like dab it on it. Perfect. 
I'll put a lip gloss on later because right now I like the matte look. But I think my makeup is done. Okay, so now I'm just gonna take this all out and brush my hair. I washed it last night, so basically I'm gonna have curly hair for school tomorrow. But I didn't want straight because straight is just boring. Okay, I've only done two. I know it looks kind of messy, but I'll sort it out once I'm completely done. I hate this mirror, like, I need a bigger mirror. But I have, like, second enough of my hair. I don't know if you can see. But it's like a little pigtail. <laughs> um, I know I, like, curl my hair weird. I just have a fear of burning my hand from past experience. <laughs> Literally, people in my school curl their hair every day. I'm like, how on earth do you do that? Like, they come to school with their hair curled. Could not me be. I literally sometimes come to school, like, bed head. Like, always come into school with bed head. So, yeah, I don't know how they do that. Okay, last part of this section. It's literally caught in my piercing, so it kind of hurts. Okay, literally my hands are shaking and I look so red, but it's because I'm actually flush, it's not the makeup. But I'm doing my earrings now and that was such a hassle. I've only done one, but literally the actual earring fell out of my ear and I couldn't find it. So, yeah, now I'm back though. I need to cool down, I need to cool down, I'm actually sweating. Because my brother and my mum have already gone downstairs and like, they're getting out of the house. I've done my hair already, so that's fine. Just do my jewelry. Okay, I'm leaving now. Here's my hair, it looks so good. I'm so happy with it. Here's the fit, got the trousers on. So yeah, I'm in a rush, but I'll film in the car. everyone I'm already back home I think it's like six or something so the, it didn't really last that long usually they last till like midnight but yeah I'm back and I'm just gonna get changed into comfy clothes because this is not the super comfy obviously I was rushing late but I'm really happy with how my hair turned out and I think it lasted like quite well because the curls are still intact which it's quite good so the hairspray did well but yeah I'm gonna get changed take off all my jewelry and makeup but yeah I hope you enjoyed the video